my name is Arzu and I'm a student rights and women in politics advocate from New Market, Ontario. I'm also the co-founder of Young Women's Leadership Network, where we aim to redefine leadership and encourage young women's civic and political involvement. I believe that it's important for young women to see themselves represented at all levels of government. It's important for women of color, queer women, and women from marginalized backgrounds to have a say and be heard in our decision-making processes. In the past two years, the budget has focused on addressing how gender-based measures have impacted women's economic and social empowerment in Canada. Through a gender-based analysis, Budget 2017 highlighted 60 measures that had differential gender impacts, but there remain many areas where data is not readily available. The budget must continue to focus on data collection and analysis to ensure better results for Canadian women. Women make up 50% of Canada's population, but hold only 26% of the seats in Parliament and represent 28% of municipal councillors across the country. Budget 2018 must empower the Ministry of Status of Women to collect in-depth data on how our education systems, labour practices and social climate contribute to women's representation at all levels of government. We must be able to identify and address the gaps in young women's capacity building and leadership. This work is already being done by many civil society organizations and community networks on a grassroots level. And financial investment will incentivize this work and help centralize the expertise around the issue of political representation.